Well, time to talk fitness. Foods that are filling may also be fattening, did you know? But a talented chef showed Lynn Smith some alternative ingredients that make some of your favorite dishes healthy and satisfying. difficult to find healthy solutions to your cravings out there and your favorite comfort foods. So Chef Jenny Brule is here to give us some alternatives to those things we may be tempted to order on the menu. Chef Jenny, thanks for being with me. Thank you so of much. Of course, that is the big bowl of pasta with meat sauce. Yes. It's so yummy and filling. Tell me about this dish. So Everybody loves pasta with meat sauce, right? But it has really simple sugars. It's got refined pasta, white flour. Um, it turns into sugar, it's not healthy, and it's got saturated fat. It's great for a treat, but not every day. So to replace that and kind of mimic that yummy flavor, we're gonna use zucchini noodles that are spiralized. And you have a pesto sauce that goes with it that gives it that filling, meaty replacement. Yes, right, it, it gives a really savory flavor. I mean, the pesto sauce, first of all, we use walnuts. Walnuts are heart healthy. They're great for your brain. They're filling, they're delicious. They're healthy fats, um, basil, garlic, lemon juice, and then nutritional yeast. Nutritional yeast, this is a secret agent. Tell the, me about that. Nutritional yeast, so this will give it the Parmesan flavor mm -hmm. without having any, any animal product in it. So this is actually vegan. Vegan, and, which people may think, right, right doesn't taste good, but. Don't freak out, don't freak out. It actually is really good. Nutritional yeast is a wonderful supplement for Parmesan cheese. And it's so creamy. It's, it's, it's creamy, it's, it's it great. It literally tastes like it has cream in it. And, it, and it's gluten-free, and you just cook the noodles for one minute in a searing mm. hot pan. It's, it's easy, it's easy. 15 minutes, dinner's done. That is incredible. Black bean burger to swap out for that big, juicy, two-pound chunk of meat that you have here. Right. But you put some interesting ingredients to make it different. Right, so, you know, I've burgers I've never heard of great. walnuts in a burger. Oh my gosh. So this is what will give it the meaty flavor and give you make you feel full because mm -hmm. there is healthy fat in walnuts. But in addition to the walnuts, we're gonna put in black beans, which are a good source of fiber and protein, and um, cooked quinoa, some green onion, Parmesan cheese for that umami flavor. Umami is a depth of flavor, it's a savoriness. Um, smoked paprika, and that's gonna mimic the, the flavor of like a grilled burger. Mm. And then I have miso paste and tomato paste, and again, that's more umami flavor. Will you join me here so that I don't, <laughs> sure. I don't look so unladylike? Absolutely. Oh, let's try this out. We just griddle these up. When you say that you mimic the, the taste of an actual burger with that paprika, I would have never thought to try that. Yeah. Oh, it's so good. It's it's good, it's healthy. There's no reason not to do it. Big savings here, and most importantly, healthy. Chef Jenny Brulé, also author of Learn to Cook 25 Southern Classics, Three Ways. Thank you so much for being with us. We're gonna put all of your recipes on our Facebook page.